Hey, what's up guys? Me and Riley coming at you today with the, the Red Tees at River Park. And it was quite fun. Fun little putting game right there. Definitely got to go back and do that. Oh, that one, 240 feet, par 3. Oh yeah, basic hyzer. Pretty easy starting hole. Just got to miss those trees. So you want to come in kind of long. Kind of high if you want. I got my stable wraith. Just trying to hit it in the back of that hill. It works out pretty good. Yep. Joey throwing some sort of mid MVP. He gets caught up on that tree on the right side. It's about 30 feet. Ooh. Yep. He hit some metal. Just not enough. So he's going to drop in that par. And I'm going to try to get that stroke on him early. Cart cam. For debris? Mm-hmm. Makes it. Woo! Yeah, that was... My heart was racing right there, but we'll take it. Hole, hole 2, 310, par 3. Yep. Pretty uh, intimidating water shot, but it's pretty easy to play it safe. I'm sure the more intimidating play is to go right side of those trees. Is that water behind it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can definitely go long, but that's kind of hard. You've got quite a bit of ground before you go long. And that's a nice shot. Mm. Joey's putting for bird. Trying to take a stab at it. Easy par. And he's trying to tie it up right here. About 35. Easy layup. Mm -hmm. And we're going to tap in those pars. And first thoughts is this course is nice. Pull three, 165 feet. Par three. It's a shorty. Some might say must get, but. Me, on the other hand, I was saying I must get this disc that I threw into that backyard over there. But that was off camera. And this was my first shot. It looks like an easy par 3, or an easy book par. Joey going back door. And that's the putt right there. So weak side. Nice little lower. Oh, that rage right there. Joey to tie it up. Count it. Mm. Yeah, that was nice. Tying it up at negative one. Hole four, 350, part three. 340. Yeah, this is the double Mando. You see the first Mando right there with that big red sign on it. Okay. So you oh. want to go super stable because this hole cuts really far left and Joey just goes straight so I'm just trying to get this up on hyzer get that glide to the left I think camera kind of misses it but it's in a better spot than this Joey going firebird trying to spike it down gets caught up on the top of that tree Kind of fluff my ringer right there. What is Joey doing? I think mean, it looks like he got his disc stuck. Yep, he got it down eventually. I got tired of filming him try to get it down. Lay up for a bogey, and this is for me to get a stroke on him. Yes. Count it. So yeah, that'll put him back at even. Wasn't liking it. Pull five, three hundred five. Or three. Yep, and uh, we we probably should have walked this hole because there is water right on the other side of that hill. Luckily, neither of us get into that water. Although this shot right here, you'll see how close it, it gets. And that was a good shot for my wraith. Joey, a little nose up. Don't see the disc. Probably okay. lost in the cloud. Yep, the top of that tree drops down. So yeah, that water right there to my right, 
definitely comes into play. Not the best upshot, but I got a punt for par. And Joe's actually jumping it. And that's a nice par look. Turning into a oh. yep, yeah, he's not happy about that. So that's two bogeys in a row. He's not happy. Hole six, two seventy five, I wanna say. Over the water? Yeah. This is a scary shot. Uh oh. It's like full six north side 2.0. Oh yeah. Yeah. So that's I'm just gonna crush a, a wraith over everything. Give myself a putt. He's not happy. Is that in the water? Yeah. Oh he landed, yeah, he hit that tree and then he went right into the middle. I thought I heard it. That's that's a putt for him right there to save his bogey. Who and was that, that for? That was for Birdie. Nice. Getting a couple strokes on him. But we are oh. 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 Yeah, he's not happy. We are playing the blue tees after this. So. Hole 7, 305 feet, par 3. Mm -hmm. So we're going to move our scores from these tees over into the blue. Because Joey's going to really need those distance holes to catch up to me at this point. So yeah, very simple shot. You just don't want to go long because there is that water right behind it. Joey's got his Stratosphere DD1 up high. Just too much height. Nice. Oh, good bid. Yeah. Easy par. He'll take that after those bogeys. And nice put. I'm not going to let the bleeding just stop. Hole 8, stop. 265, par 3. Yeah, and this one definitely played maybe a little longer than that, but you got it's up on the hill, so you got to backstop. just want to go stable. And that's just way too short for me. And Joey's not going to be short. He liked it. Almost went in. Backstop trying to run it. But you got to worry about the roll. The roll is going all the way down. But I have a putt from 15 or so. A little high, but it drops. I got away with something right there. Joey to get a stroke on me. Yeah, good sit. We've seen him roll. So he'll, he'll get that nine, far. 515, par 4. Yeah, and, and this hole, I loved it. It had all the risk and reward you could want for a finishing hole. Pretty easy to get a, a birdie. And that just didn't flip for me. So I'm going to have to work for that low score. That was stuck in the tree. Joey getting that distance way down there and I got a scary shot oh, oh barely that was, that was so close. <laughs> I was scared the whole time until I saw it hit the ground uh -oh. and that's a safe shot that's pretty close. but yeah yeah he's close he's putting this is for my birdie which I would love. Oh. Just not enough. Want. Joey to get a stroke on me. Count it. He gets one going into the final nine. And he's feeling good. He's going to have the box on hole one blue tees. Alright guys. Thanks for joining us. Nice clip right here. So we'll see y'all on the blue tees for the final nine. Thanks. Bye.